Good afternoon, everybody. This is Nate over at Bullion RV. Just did a video yesterday, but we got another video coming out for you today. And today I have a 2025, that's right, you heard me, 2025 Cherokee Wolf Den 26 EV. 26 EV meaning no propane, all battery. Once again, no propane, all battery. So stats are gonna pop up at the beginning of the video. We're gonna show you some features on the outside, kind of the new quirks on the inside here. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Be easy on me, let's get started. So coming around to the front, you'll see the front cap here with the new Forest River logo, very aggressive. We got our rock guard right here and where the propane would be, like I said, you don't have that. So we do install the battery upon purchase. Like I said, no propane, but uh, this will run off of your battery. Just taking a step back and getting a view of the side profile here. This doesn't have a slide. This is a bunkhouse that sleeps up to eight. We'll get a view of the dry weight right here, coming in at 4302. Moving on down the line, you're gonna have your water heater, fresh water connection, and city water connection. Double axle on this one. And you do have, if the GoPro can pick it up here, you do have your enclosed underbelly. Our low point drain off to the left. 30 amp service right here. Got a nice little light on the outside. Wastewater holding tank, sewer outlet connections. And then you do have your manual jacks sitting right here. Getting a view of the rear of the camper. Again, there's that new Forest River aggressive uh, lettering, if you will. Just another side view of the other side here before we walk in. First little storage compartment here. You got quite a bit of room to work with. And these are your magnetic latches here too. down there larger windows letting in some of that natural light you do have a spot for a tv out here and we do have our gfci outlets here hc15 chassis on this and like i mentioned the 26 ev logo you do have a large power awning it was raining earlier today so i didn't want to run the risk of having that get soaked and you also do have an LED light strip that goes uh, beneath that. Moving on in, right off to the left, you'll have that fire extinguisher for your safety. So like I mentioned, this does sleep up to eight and no slide, but you still have plenty of room to walk around. And starting things off here, I kind of have the couch down in that jackknife uh, set up depending on how many, uh, you know, if you're uh, smaller children that need to sleep. I personally think you could sleep two there. Nice little electric fireplace on that here. You got your TV mount, plug-ins up above. This is going to have a lot of storage in it, so you're probably going to hear me use the word storage 12 million times. But storage here, and you got a lot of these little... Uh, little cubes for storage scattered throughout, which I think is really cool for smaller knickknacks, anything that you're gonna store. Just tons of them everywhere. And even if you don't want these, you can just move them out and have something down below if you wanna put your shoes there, do anything like that. Over to the bedroom here, you have your curtain behind me for a little bit more privacy. Queen 60 by 80 bed. Lots of device charging outlets throughout. More GFCI outlets there, here, and then we do have our USB here as well. And then these are all touch lights. So if you want to adjust your lighting, you gotta do everything by touch. Obviously on the left and right hand side, you have a lot more of those storage cubes that I mentioned. Smoke alarm right up above me. Moving this back up. Don't mind my throwing things around. So then you do have your couch if you do want to have your TV right here. Some more storage up above. 
AC right up above me here. There's that electric fireplace that I mentioned. A little bit of storage here. Nice countertops for something that doesn't have a slide. And then, like I mentioned at the be uh, very beginning of the video, all of the stats are gonna pop up, but there's a little bit more of a highlight for them as well. If you wanna pause the video, get a little bit more knowledge, feel free to do so. Nice spot here for your dinette as I'm waiting for somebody to come have breakfast, lunch, or dinner with me. Nothing happening yet, but we'll save that for another time. Microwave with, or a convection microwave with air fry capability. Be easy on me in the comments in that last one. That was my attempt at dry humor. Lots of storage up above if you want to put, uh, you know, use that as, I'm not going to say pantry, but for spices, anything else cooking related, you got a lot of room to work with there. Nice double fridge. And these are taped right now, but you do have your uh, little freezer area that slides out. This just came in, so I don't want to destroy anything. Again, you, you're, you're hearing me right, more cubes for storage. And again, even if I'm taking this, even if I'm taking this cube out, you can use this for whatever you want. Moving the bathroom door, so I'm gonna step out of the way here real quick. So you got your double over double bunks. Exit window down below. And even if you're using from the bottom there, you do have some more storage. That's where that first storage cubby opened up to. So if you wanna store from outside to inside or inside to outside, you could do that. More storage that you see up here. And then I'm gonna open up the bathroom door so we can get a shot of the bathroom. Surprised again with no, well, there's not gonna be a bathroom slide, but no slide in this unit, how much bathroom space you have to walk around in. And then just coming back out here. So you'll have a QR code off to the or off to the entry door here to get a little bit more knowledge on your 26 EV. You got the buttons for your awning, the monitor for your tanks, your heater or your uh, furnace and your water pump, some outlets down here for device charge device charging. So that's going to be a walkthrough of this brand new 2025 uh, 26 EV or Cherokee Wolf Den 26 EV. If you want some more information about this unit, all my information is going to be in the description box below. Feel free to give me a call, send me an email, set up an appointment with me. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. We'll catch you in the next one.